hello can you guys hear me okay good morning you wonder how mad father is today i don't know it's early in the morning so he shouldn't be too mad right <laughs> he shouldn't be too mad right it's it's like nine in the morning he shouldn't be too mad right now Maybe we, we maybe we chose a good time to interact with Mad Father. Maybe he'll be in a nice mood today. Can you hear me all good? Okay, good. Okay. I was gonna do a little chatting before starting, but it's already like past nine. Um, so let us get started with the game. We can actually do some chatting tomorrow because tomorrow's my day off because today finally is Saturday. You know, funny story, funny story about like, you know how yesterday I thought, for some reason yesterday I thought it was Saturday. Uh, while I was at work, there was a lady that was like, dude, like today I thought it was Saturday. And I was like, no way. That's such a funny coincidence. I thought it was Saturday too. <laughs> some, la some random lady that I was like checking out at the register. I thought it was really funny that she also had that same <laughs> that same thought. She's like, I, th I honestly thought it was Saturday. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah, I, get, I have tomorrow off, so yay. I think tomorrow I'm going to try and jump back into Yuppie Psycho. Because I really want to jump back into that game. I just, I got lost and I didn't know where to go. But I do want to jump back into that game. So I think that's what we're going to do tomorrow. And then I think my next day off is Friday. So between Monday and Thursday, I'll try to do morning streams if I can, if I'm not too tired. Oh, and for the people that are, the people that are using like, I think Chrome, uh, uh, BTTV emotes should be available to you guys. I don't know if it works for all browsers, but I noticed that I can use them. So if you guys are using like Chrome or something, it should pop up. I mean, Corona has been popping up. See? <laughs> Firefox forever, huh? I don't know. I don't know if I install it for all of them. They'll be available for all browsers, but so far I just have Chrome. I'll test that out later today. The fact that I even got it working surprised me. That's kind of why I started stream a little late. Because I was working on trying to get the BTTV emotes working because I really want them to work because I used to have them to be able to work but they stopped working for a while and I did I couldn't figure out why Chrome is pretty solid too really really even with all the all the what, what were we saying about it the information or, or the, the information they keep taking from you okay yeah, the privacy stuff, yeah. I don't know. Oh, hold on. Actually, let me put this full screen. And let me push one button over here. Actually, I'm going to push a couple buttons over here. There we go. personal preference for Firefox okay I used to like Firefox when I was a kid I don't know why I stopped using it oh my goodness it got huge there we go okay now the controls for this game is really weird so I might need to like set up the controls because you know how like in Japanese games the circle is sometimes like confirmation for this game, for some reason, confirmation is square, and I don't know why, so... 
Oh, this thing is also loud too. Jeez. Oh, these sounds are so loud. Okay, does it sound okay? Hopefully it's not as loud as me. Let's see. What's the back button? So back button is X for some reason. Gosh, it's gonna be I'm going under the control settings. Let's see. Confirm button, I will say. Okay. Cancel button. Circle, I guess? And then special what is special button? What is this what is the special button? I don't know. What does that even mean? Special button. I guess square, I guess? What does that mean? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Alright, we're gonna turn off the cute cozy music and we're gonna start playing the actual background music for the game. Okay. Let's see what time is it? It's 9:22. Okay, so we got a little bit of time. I'll try and stay until like 11:30, but then I kind of like have to start getting ready for work. But if I have enough energy, I'll try and be back after work. So, you might see me on like at midnight. Just so you guys know. Is this loud enough or should I increase the volume? It's at 50 it's at 50% right now. How far ahead of you are you to me, Bear? How many hours ahead of you are are you? Sounds fine. Okay. It's 12.30. Oh my god, it's min- <laughs> Is it midnight for you? Sheesh. Okay. Let's lower the voice acting, because I don't know if the, uh, the voice volume is going to be really loud. So I'm going to put it like around 70. Yeah, that looks, that looks pretty reasonable. Okay. Select scenario. Okay, so we need to start with normal mode. Okay. Start from the prologue. Of course, start from the prologue. I'm here for the story. I love I love the stories in these kind of games. Alrighty, alrighty. gonna suck when I have to go back to work because I won't be awake around this time anymore. Aww. You're not gonna be- <laughs> But you're my little Einstein. You're always helpful. Wolf RPG editor. Hmm. try okay just do your best
What time is it for you when it's like midnight for me, Bear? down the line so <laughs> I was actually thinking that when I was starting this game I was thinking about Talibur like reminding you but I'm like nah nah I shouldn't I don't have to remind him but yeah your recommend your game recommendation is on the line here who was it Chiaki that recommended paper lily Because of how positive of a review I made of Paper Lily, I will take recommendations of games from Chiaki. <laughs> we'll see if I take recommendations from you, Bear. We'll see. Hi, I'm Chiaki. <laughs> Hi. Father. Father, are you there? <gasps> Father! How many times have I told you not to come down here? Sorry, Father. But, um, I'm too scared to sleep on my own. I, uh, don't worry, you're never alone. Your late mother is always there at your side. She's always watching over you, Aya. Okay, now please go to bed. Yes, father. Good girl. Head pats. Father, tomorrow's... Yes, the anniversary of her death. We'll visit her grave together. Okay. Now back to bed, please. I'll be resting too shortly. Yes, Father. Stop! No! Help me! Help! What the fuck? That escalated quickly, what the fuck? <laughs> I know father's secrets. My father is a scientist. He loves research. And is always locked up in the lab in the basement. Oh my god, this reminds me of that fucking guy from Fullmetal Alchemist Brotherhood. What was that little girl's name? Nina? Reminds me of Nina's dad. What was his name? What was his name? I can't remember his name. That's a Texas Chiso. Oh, hey, Kibo. Hi, Edoc. Hello. Do you guys remember the guy from, from uh, Fullmetal Alchemist? The one who made his daughter into a chimera? That's literally the vibes I get from this guy. We only have one joke. <laughs> I, yeah, yeah. Dang, I keep I think of Fulmer Alchemist. I keep thinking about like back in the day when like the voice actors were so popular and they used to go to conventions. Dang, the Ed and Rory voice actors were crazy back in the day. <laughs> Is that his name? Wait, the it, you mean this father's name or you mean like the the guy from Fulmer Alchemist? I don't remember his name. His name wasn't worth remembering because he's a piece of shit. I've always heard things from that lab. Rip Nina. Was it Albert? I'll Google it later. 
but you guys know who I'm talking about. You know who I'm talking about. You know it's funny. After finishing chapter one of Paper Lily yesterday, I had the same feeling that I that I had when I finished Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. I don't know what. <laughs> I was so sad when I finished Brotherhood because I knew there wasn't any more and I got so sad about it. Animal and human screams. Even at a young age, I knew what my father was doing. So I pretended I wasn't looking. That I didn't know or hear anything. I feigned ignorance the whole time. Because I love the father. That's really crazy. That's not the only secret I know. When, when mom and I weren't around, he and his helper. No. No. He has a side bitch? <laughs> Is his assistant his side bitch? His side hole? A fine sample. I shall dispose of the remaining materials myself. That can wait. Come, Maria. Doctor. You fucking. You fucking homewrecker. You homewrecking piece of shit. This bitch. How dare she when she knows that he's married? Dude. <laughs> Not gonna lie, he got game. What, this guy? This guy don't got game. He looks like a nerd. He ain't got no riz. The mistress is aware of our relationship. Hmm. What does it matter? Oh my god, this guy's a piece of shit. And she- and this girl, Aya, still loves her father, even knowing all of this bullshit. I'm surprised she even, like, looks at her father. I wouldn't even spit in the same direction as this man. I don't believe she's fond of me. Of course she wouldn't be fond of me, you're a fucking homewrecker. You're here sleeping with her husband. What the f- You think she would like you? She belongs to the streets? Yeah, this woman belongs to the streets. She's a 304. Man's a pimp. <laughs> what, is this her bottom- Is this his bottom bitch or is his wife his bottom bitch? You know what a bottom bitch is, right? I learned it from South Park. <laughs> She's, she's, she's the bitch that's above all the other bitches, but she's still a bitch. Gendo? Gendo? Gendo from what? Butters a pimp, yeah, heck yeah. <laughs> Butters is the best pimp ever. All of these, all of these girls are kissing fellers when they don't know they sh they could be making some motherfucking money. <laughs> I love Butters. I think he, like he's my favorite character in South Park. You forgot to add. Do you know what I am saying? Oh yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Oh, Butters. Everyone knows it's Butters. That's me. The girl will be 11 soon. It's troubles It's a troublesome age to be sure. Be kind to her, please. Ensure that she never comes to harm. She shall always be my most precious. Right. Right. Is that what you told your wife before you started cheating on her? If I was this girl, I would have run away already. It's midnight. T 
Today is the day mom went to heaven. Mom. Now that I'm thinking about mom, I can't get to sleep. That's my favorite doll. Ew. Did I tell you guys my parents got me one of these kind of dolls, but like life size? Like when I was like four. So it was kind of like almost my height. And I was so afraid of it. They got it to me. They got it for me for Christmas. And like literally the day after Christmas, I snuck it out and I threw it in the trash because it scared the shit, it scared the shit out of me. <laughs> these kind of dolls freak me out. I hate these kind of dolls. They never found out. <laughs> Rosen Maiden. I I just don't like the eyes. The eyes are so fucking creepy. Three Michelle goes today would all burn. The ones that creep me out are the ones that have the eyes that actually like move around when you like tilt them. Like those dolls scare the shit out of me. The ones that don't blink, it, they're not as creepy, but the ones that do blink, I do not like at all. A doll I got from father. It's so old and worn. I brought you a present, Aya. Aw, oh, she looks so cute little. Look how cute she looks. Hey, look, we're sharing the same hairstyle. Except I don't have bows in my head. <gasps> Yay, it's a doll. Thank you, Father. What a pretty doll. It's almost like it's alive. The red-eyed stranger. Huh? Something fell out. What's this? A gem. Gems are hidden in various places. Some require doing special events to get. You can see your gem count in the menu. Find them all and something might happen. A portrait of mom. Mom. Damn, she got big booba. What should I do, Mom? I do love Father, but... She scares me. She's always looking at me with those eyes. I hate her. But I know Father likes her. If Father and her get married, I guess she would be my new mom. I don't want her to be my mom. I don't need a new mom. There's only one mom in the world for me. Mom. Why did you have to go? A bunny. Snowball, the pet rabbit. The room feels cold all of a sudden. I'm kind of scared. I should get back to bed. too dark to see a thing. Good night.
you sing so well, Aya. Can I turn around now, Father? Just a moment. Just put this here. Yes, it's finished. A flower crown? Does it look good on me? Yes, I think it suits you well. Yay! Thank you, Father. I'm sorry I can't always play with you. Father. It's alright. I'm glad we could finally play together, Father. Damn! He cheated on this with that... That... that. <laughs> Why is the side hoe always uglier than the main... Than the, than the main wife? She's so pretty. Why the fuck would he cheat on this woman? Like, look at her. Jeez. You can't compare the two, man. This woman's like a gem. And that other woman's like a like a rock or something. <laughs> you can save her from this the mom. <laughs> you wanna save the mom keyboard? I mean, who wouldn't want to save the mom? I mean, look at her. A lot of people don't know what they got till it's gone. Me, personally, I couldn't be out here lacking. Lack? What? What's, what's that supposed to mean? I'm not good with, like, lingo and stuff, so if you could explain what that means. Oh my. How unusual. You two are playing? Mom! Look! Father made me a flower crown! That's wonderful! It looks great on you, Aya. So you played with him all day? Yeah! We should do this again, Father. Yes, we should. Next time, your mother should join in. Well... I look forward to it. <coughs> Mom! I'm sorry. Just another fit. Don't, put your sh don't push yourself if you're not feeling well. Come, get some, get some medicine from Maria. It should help you get better. I can get that myself. Oh, she low-key knows. Oh, she low-key knows. She's like, fuck Maria. I don't want that bitch giving me stuff. <laughs> she knows. Look at that face. She knows. Mom, are you hurt? You're okay, right? Sorry to worry you. I'm perfectly fine. Don't look so anxious, please. Aya, your smile keeps me going best of all. If I can't see you smiling, it only makes me worry. Mom. Okay. Now let's get back for dinner. I made sirloin. Ooh, yummy sirloin steak. Your favorite, Aya. Hooray! I love mom's steaks. Right, Father? <laughs> of course. She makes the best steaks in the world. I can slip up after having a wife who like that. Yeah. Man, this, this guy. This guy was lucky to even have this woman. We were so happy then. There was Maria too, but 
Even so, the three of us were a happy family. But then mom passed away from illness. And all that happiness we just, we had just. Ah! <laughs> what? That scream. Could that have been father? Something must have happened. I'll go check on father. Oh, I have a bad feeling. What? This way. Who's that? Come this way. Is there someone there? What the? Who the? Who the fuck is? <gasps> who are you? This way. But who are you? Stay with me. What the? I said this way. No! Oh god, I have no options. <laughs> what? Who's that? Many interesting books in this room here. Do you like books, my dear? Who are you? Get out of my room! <laughs> Oh, no need to be so wary. I'm merely a salesman. Why are you in my room? There's clearly a sign out front of my room that says no soliciting. Salesman? He looks like a vampire. Call me Ogre. What are you, an ogre? I hope to get to know you, young lady. <laughs> But it's quite troublesome to think that corpses wander the mansion. Corpses? Those monsters back there? And they're like creatures from a story. Why would monsters like that suddenly... Well, it's a curse. What you saw were the corpses of your father's test subjects. Overcome with anger, those deceased have been brought back to by the power of a curse. To take revenge on your father, of course. What? I have to save him! No, you don't. He made his bed, he should lie in it. Why is that? Towards his own ends, he has killed countless people as part of his ex Exactly. You know what? I agree with this sales guy. This is his retribution. That's what I'm saying. He gets what he gets. You must have realized by now your father's true nature. And yet you wish to save him? Mm. What a fool. My, my. Perhaps she cannot yet understand their suffering. I have to go save father. Crow? Can I go this way to see this person? Oh, okay, I guess never mind. God, 
<laughs> that that surprised me. Oh, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Looks like a friendly chap. I mean, kind of. I don't know. I feel like I could trust him more than I could trust Father. A doll? If I kept walking, I might have stepped on it. When the red fog covers the screen, it means quick time event has begun. You must press the buttons displayed on the screen within the time limit. If you fail, it may result in a game over. Well, that's nice. That's nice to know. Discarded dolls blocks the way. This wasn't here when I came down earlier. I can't get through here. I need to think of a way to get to Father's lab. What the? What? Why was that doll moving? Is that part of the curse too? <gasps> oh god. Oh my god, what the f- <sighs> Can I go back? Cheese, cheese and crackers. My goodness, there's so many monsters everywhere. Is that a doggo? Yikes, it's pitch black. I can't go down there. Oh my god, is this dog gonna kill me? Hmm. 
Oh, good. I wonder if I can grab that knife. But let me go save one more time before I try. Like maybe I can I use a can I use that knife for defense? I'm surprised the dog hasn't noticed me yet. Gosh. I should stay away. Okay. Well, if we can't go this way... Container full of oil. Hmm. Maybe we can use the oil? What the? What was that? Okay. So it doesn't look like we can go anywhere here yet. Will this lead to the same place? Yes, it will. Okay. So let's try going over here. How's my father going? Uh, we found out father is a bitch. Uh, he had a side hoe the entire time while his wife was dying. Um, so yeah, so far we we think dad's a bitch, and he deserves what's coming to him, and we don't understand why we're trying to save him. That's basically where we're at right now. <laughs> Considering how I only ever saw the vanilla version there's a lot going on so far what do you mean the vanilla version there's a different version there's a different version of this i played mad for honor i think it was three months back there's a lot to unpack really is this a is this a long game uh, oh sh oh my god that's <laughs> that scared me I can't reach. Maybe I can use this chair? What? What was that sound? It sounded like... <clears throat> An old key. that I feel like I just heard a voice you know what before I talk if I do anything else I'm gonna say was this Powerfully moving painting. <gasps> oh, my God. <laughs> Took me six hours to finish, so it's long. Oh my gosh. I don't know. If it took you six hours, it might take me longer. 
because I like to take my time with games. Like, even for Shy Lily. Shy Lily took me, like, how many hours total? But then again, I did replay the beginning a couple times. It took me, I have, like, a total of, like, eight hours or something. Nine hours or something on, on Paper Lily. The painting was hiding a cylinder lock safe. I can't open this without the key. Don't I have the key, though? If I remember right, this knife is a memento from great-grandfather. It might be useful for something. Should be fine to borrow it, right? Okay. Nah, I'm not gonna play music right now. <laughs> I feel like playing any sound is a bad idea right now. Gosh. <gasps> Everything is so suspicious. Oh my god, I don't want to go to that mirror, but I think I might have to. <gasps> oh good, it wasn't something super scary. Okay, it was just a jump scare. Is there anything useful in this room? Maria said she's planning to throw this dress out because it's too raggedy. Feels like a waste to me. Wait, did Maria say that? Maria's a bitch. Don't listen to what Maria says. That's suspicious. That's weird. Maybe I shouldn't be in here. People need to stop eating jam in the bath. Yeah. So messy. <gasps> oh shit. Oh shit. Uh, oh my god, I'm cornered. What the fuck? <laughs> How am I supposed to get out of there? How am I supposed to get out of there? Hold on. Can I open my menu? Why can't I open my menu? Oh, there we go. I have a dagger. Can't I just use it and stab that thing? Gosh. Okay, hopefully I can- hopefully I can run- maybe I just have to run out. <laughs> Oh good. Okay, okay, we made it. My grandpa caught a gray 
Wait, a groundhog? Oh, that's cute. Did he like capture it on purpose or did he like find it in like a trap or something? Mystery room, huh? It's either the mystery room. Oh, it's locked. Okay, never mind. I guess we, our decision's been made. We're going down this way. Oh, wait, never mind. It's going up. Who the fudge is this? A life-size doll. Did it wink? Did it just wink at me? Am I just seeing things? <gasps> oh my god, what the... I thought I was going to die again. Do you like these kind of RPG type games? Yeah. Didn't you guys think I was going to... I thought I was going to die. And I was like, I, try, I was trying to get back out of the room. Like, I can't move. What the fuck? Some medicine father takes. Oh, God. Give back my daughter. Spirit in bedroom is looking for her daughter. Where would her daughter be? I don't even know what her daughter looks like. How would I know what her daughter looks like? I don't remember the code to unlock it. Locate hint for the safe. Okay. How am I going to find her daughter? <laughs> Bitch, what the fuck? I'm just walk. Why'd you trip me? <laughs> Why'd you trip me? You're lucky. You're lucky you're just a doll. Fucking bitch, you laughed at me. That's kind of funny, I'm not gonna lie. That weird guy's gone. Luckily, my bunny's still alive. There's a dead cat inside. <gasps> Oh. Yeah, let's just close that. Mm. Can I just go back to bed? Forget this whole day happened. Oh my god, I don't know if I should take him with me. He might be safer in here. I'll just pet him. I hope you survive, Snowball. If not me, I hope you survive. Did I come from this room? The doll father made for me. I have a feeling they're all just gonna attack me at once. This one looks pretty though. I like this doll. This doll looks pretty.
I'm surprised it didn't attack me. Hi, Goro. Hi, Yuki. Don't take that. I should grab that dagger and stab that doll, huh? Should assert my dominance. Let me go back. Well then. Ha ha. Serves you right, you stupid doll. That's what you get for tripping me. I just noticed how this girl walks. Why does she walk with her hands up like this like she's dainty? Look at her. Look at her walk. <laughs> I just noticed how her walk is so dainty. Such a dainty girl. It's locked. Hey, it's that bald guy. Oh, I thought that was going to be useful, a useful book, but I guess not. Guess it was just there for spooky purposes. An old diary. Humans are beautiful. But that beauty soon fades. That is the law of this world. But I have overturned it. After years of research, I have found eternal beauty. A body that will never fade in, even in death. A body as fresh as it is, as it was in life. They have eternal beauty within their grasp. As we lose believers year by year, our group stands on the brink of extinction. Group. What is he? What is he? A cult leader? This, he's starting to sound like a cult leader. My body too is nearing its limits. I must find a successor as soon as possible. That's suspicious. That's weird. Oh, that just confirmed my suspicions. Uh, again, I'm assuming that means January. And I'm assuming the X means the 10th. This is a nightmare. How could this have happened? Killed a bird. Just like... The rest of the pages are unreadable. The archives are blue. Archives are blue? It's raining cats and dogs outside. Real, <laughs> real beefy weather. I love the rain. I wish it was raining. January the Janth. Hey! Bald guy left. I was literally about to talk to him. Data on live experimentation. When did bald guy leave? I didn't even notice he left. <gasps> There's something stuck in here. Got code memo. Oh god. Is this the is this the daughter that that other spirit was looking for? 
It hurts. Help me. <gasps> I want to go home. I want to see mama. Fucking, this fucking, I get, I get so pissed looking at this bitch now. <laughs> Fuck Maria. I don't want to see her face. Don't worry, I shall, I shall take you to her once this is all over. No, I want to go now. Mama! Don't fret, everything will be fine. We just wish to test this medicine. It may hurt a bit, but don't worry. You'll soon feel such relief. No! Mama! Stop. Stop, I don't want this. Maybe now we should go back to that room where the mother is, or was. What's that sound? I gotta go in a bit, gotta get ready for work. Oh, well same here, I gotta get ready for work in like an hour and a half. What was that sound? Who's that? Should I be afraid of that sound? I'm so curious, but I maybe I shouldn't try to find out. You know what? I'm I'm curious. There's only one you guys want me to find out? Dang, okay, okay, okay. No, I'm gonna find out. Oh, look, she doesn't come back now. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Where'd that? Oh, oh my god. I don't wanna. Okay, you go fudge it. Fudge it. What? What was that? Why'd she run away? Is that the lady? Who's that? a hint. Hold on. Can I look at the note? Let's see. Written hints for unlocking the bedroom safe. With this, you can solve the safe code. Chandeliers in the entrance hall. Changing room hats. Bathroom pillars, red dolls in the doll room, barrels in the cafeteria. So do I have to count for each one of these? My dreams are always open-ended, and once I'm into it, I don't want to force myself to stop. I know I'm kind of like that too, but when I, whenever I work, I have to limit myself. He couldn't just write the. I know, like. <laughs> Could it just write the numbers down? 
I couldn't stream before work. No. See, the thing is, I get off work so late, it's kind of like hard for me to stream after work. That's why I try to stream before work. Okay, so chandeliers in the entrance hall. Okay, let's see. Guys, keep count with me, okay? Keep count. God knows I'm not going to remember all of it. <laughs> okay, how many chandeliers in the entrance hall? Okay, so we have... Oh, shit. These bitches. Are they always going to be there? Okay. I think it's just four. Yeah, I think it's just four. Okay, so the first number is four. What was the next hint? The next hint... Changing room hats. Wait, is that... Do I have to subtract the amount of changing room hats to the number of bathroom pillars? Shit, they're asking me to do math too? Bro, they're asking way too much of me. Okay, now where's the changing room? I forget where the changing room is. Where's the changing room? These are the archives. Saw room. Bed. Oh, no, I didn't want to go in there. Nursery. Okay, my bunny's still okay. Haha, <laughs> you stupid doll. That's what you get for tripping me. Okay. I couldn't enter this room before. That's the bathroom I need. So. Okay, so changing room. How many hats? One, two, three, four, five. I think five. Five hats. So, four number of chandeliers. Five hats. I'm assuming minus. How many pillars in the bathroom? Are there any pillars in the bathroom? It said bathroom pillars, right? Or am I illiterate? Oh, I am illiterate. <laughs> I am illiterate. Planters. Okay, one, two, three. I see three planters. So five minus three would be two. So the next number would be two. So the code so far is four and two. Okay, four and two. All right, remember that, guys. Remember that. All right, the next one is red dolls in the doll room. Okay. So we head back to the doll room. Wait, will this lead us there? I think it will. Four, two. How many red dolls? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so four, two, six, and the last one is barrels in the cafeteria. I think the cafeteria is here. Barrels in the cafeteria. Is this what the- wait, is that what an- am I being illiterate again? Barrels in cafeteria. Uh, do they mean the kitchen? Because there's nothing in the cafeteria. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Would these count?
So four, two, six, nine. Oh wait, the bedroom over here, I think. Oh, one way to find out. Four, two, six, nine. Shit. Okay, well, let's try doing it without the ones on the side. That would be three. Four, two, six, three. Let's try that. Four, two, six. Fudge. Am I am I doing this wrong? Barrels in the cafeteria. Maybe they literally mean cafeteria. So would that be zero? Because I didn't see any in the cafeteria, just in the kitchen. Sugar cookies. Now I gotta go back to the cafeteria and see what it is. Alright, back to the cafeteria. What do they mean by barrels, though? I don't see shit. You must be blind. See, I, <laughs> I tried those numbers. But this is the kitchen. It's It specifically said cafeteria. There's just barrels I don't see. Am I blind too? Maybe we counted something else wrong. Maybe we counted something else wrong. Let's see, how many dolls? Red. We have one, two, three. Three on this side that are red. Three on this side that are red. Okay. Maybe we miscounted the chandeliers in the entrance hall? But I only see four. I only count four. Maybe I miscounted planters. One, two, three. I only see three planters in here. Maybe I miscounted the hats? Hmm. One, two. Yeah, it says five hats. Seems like I counted everything right. 
I just don't understand what it means like barrels in the cafeteria. Four chandeliers in the entrance hall. Oh, wait. Wait, changing room hats minus the bathroom planters, which is five hats and three planters in the bathroom, so that would be two. There are six dolls in the doll room that are red. And I don't see any barrels in the cafeteria. So this should be the right code, shouldn't it? I don't know why this isn't working. Maybe this is a code for a different safe, maybe. But I don't think I've seen another safe. But this, it says it's the safe for the bedroom. What am I counting wrong? Multiple bathrooms? Maybe. I haven't seen another bathroom though. Hmm. Oh shit! Oh my god, they're not letting me in! Oh my fucking god. <laughs> oh my god, they're not letting me go through the door. I'm gonna try going through the doors that they pop out of. Let's see, is there another bat? There's a reception room. Check the other side. Oh. Oh my god, they cornered me. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. No, this just leads to the same place. This just leads to the same place. Bathroom hallway. <gasps> oh, sugar cookies. see three planters. Sheesh. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna double check this because I feel like I feel like we're right. And I can't find another bathroom.
what? Wait. Okay. Let's see. Someone said four two eight zero. Let me see. But I only see six dolls with, with, I only see six red dolls. Am I miscounting? One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't see any other red doll. Why are they saying eight? There's only six in the doll room. Let me try. Why? I don't understand. I counted six. Am I am I not am I dumb? Can I not count? Maybe sometimes the event changes it. I don't know. I don't understand. I would not have figured that out unless I looked it up. Especially because I counted everything. Dude, what the fuck? I can't understand. <laughs> What did it mean by eight? There were only six. It contains mom's belongings. I can smell mom's scent. There's a lamp in here. It's pretty dark, so I'd have to... So it'd be nice to have a light. Just borrowing this, Mom. Mom's perfume. Is he still at work? <gasps> oh my god, this is when she saw his dad banging that stupid side hoe. Father? Aya, oh yeah, there you are. Doesn't your father always tell you not to go into the basement? M Mom. <gasps> he... I knew it. He's cheating on me with that, that, I don't know. Come up with bad names for her, guys. That, I, I can't come up with a bad name for her. I've already called her so many bad names. With that bitch? <laughs> I can't believe this. Some girl he picked up off, ex oh my god, right off the street she's calling her 3042. You're right. She does belong to the streets, mom.
Mom's usually so nice, but that day she was like a different person. Maybe an interact somewhere in the room, somewhere around the room. You mean in the doll room, Bear? So she took care of it. That's good. After all, Mom got this from Father on their anniversary. I'll take it as a good luck charm. All right, Mom. What the? <gasps> oh shit. Oh my god, I'm fucking up. Ah, <laughs> I started pushing up. Lucky you can fight back. <laughs> Let's go pet my bunny. I want to keep my bunny safe. Maybe that's why it was eight. I don't think these dolls were up here before I did the did that event in the room. So I had to do that event before I came over here to count that shit. Bro, that's not fair. <laughs> Well, now we know why it's eight and not six. Okay, let's see. Maybe I can use the lamp. Oh shit. Into the storehouse. Is there something blocking the way? Hmm. A pendant found in the archive, it sprang back and forth as if searching for someone.
Hmm, you can't open that door yet either. Okay, I need to do something with that character. What do I need to do? Maybe... Oh my god. I did not see that coming. She better not come back. Oh my god, this bitch. Oh my god, this bitch cornered me. Ah! <laughs> Can I move the cart? Gosh. I can't move anything around here. And I can't interact with this anymore. What am I supposed to do here? Move these barrels? No. Maybe there's another way to get... This fucking bitch. Hmm. Maybe I need to do something here, too. There's no real direction for me to go here. Oh shit. Oh, she cornered me. Son of a biscuit. That noise actually made me jump slightly before the playing horror game. There was a monster beside me. That's funny. Hyper violent? It's kind of a 90s shooter with some horror elements. Huh. Maybe... I don't know. I can't interact with this anymore. Let me see if there are any other missions. The missions are still the same. Maybe I need to do something else before I come back here. You 
I'm gonna leave it like that. I don't think there's anywhere else to go. Hmm. Maybe this is just a dead end, maybe. Go back to the kitchen. Still can't enter. I am stumped. Where, am I, where else am I supposed to go? Where am I supposed to put the pendant? Maybe I'm supposed to place the pendant somewhere. Searching for someone, but I don't know where to put it. Thank you. 
Now I'm switching to another game called Long Dark. Long Dark? Maybe a doll or something you can put on it? I've been trying to put it on stuff. Oh, am I gonna have to look this up too? Like... Maybe try putting the pendant doll on my doll, maybe? I mean, it all happened here, and there's a ghost waiting for something here. But I don't know what to do with it. A pendant found in the archives. And the archives, I think, is where the little girl was. The mom was in this room, looking for her daughter. So logically, I would think you would need to put the pendant somewhere around here. Where the mom, I guess, was. Hmm. Ah, let me see. Let me see what I can find. Really, dude, 
I literally had to walk up to the window and use the pendant. How would I have known that? That doesn't make any sense. That's ridiculous. I went everywhere in this room with the pendant, but it wouldn't... I... Oh, well... I hate that I have to look things up, though. It's really annoying that I have to look things up. But I guess you can't really help it with these old games. They really don't give you that many hints, and they're pretty... pretty vague about what you need to do with the items. This is her pendant. Aww. Kalina. Mama. Aww. Oh, shit. <laughs> hmm. Jeez. Oh, there's a door up here. I wonder if I can go in there. Oh, we can. Oh my god, what the fuck's that sound? It's the only direction you can go. I guess I can't do anything there either. Like score. I feel like Corpse Party was more straightforward though. you hit the bad ends. So it's keeping me away from that, so I can't do anything with that.
The only room we can't enter is this room right here. But I've explored every other room. <sighs> maybe because the firewood and the reception fire? Oh, maybe. Maybe. Let me go back and check. Maybe. Maybe, baby. Maybe, baby. Maybe, baby. Maybe, baby. We'll see. It says I need a hint to use this item. So I don't think it can. Hmm. The only other items I have is just dagger and firewood. Maybe a book will tell you about the wood. See, I've read all the books, though. There's not that many books to read. They just talk about the cult. The flame? Huh? The flame egg? That wasn't available before. There's a girl who has the mysterious power to control fire. And she goes on a journey to find the family she's been separated from. Proclaiming, burn all those in my way. She did exactly that to all her foes. But I think in the end, her power got out of control and destroyed the world. Till she never met her family in the end. She was all alone. A poor girl all alone. If I lose father, I'll be alone too. I don't want it. I have to save father, quick. Burn all those in my way. Huh? Yeah. I can burn it, but I'll need something to start a fire with. I think there was some part in the flame egg about making a torch. Oh my god. <laughs> it's annoying when things aren't available, and then they're available, and they don't tell you it's available. Bro. Maybe what triggered it was the fact that I finished the pendant thing. Maybe that's what triggered this. I don't know. I guess it doesn't matter as long as we can keep the story going. I have the material to make a torch. Okay, so now we can just go to the reception area. And now we can make it. Why did we have to go through all that trouble just to light firewood I don't have all the what, what? oh do I need oil now do I need oil wait what other material would I need oh wrong way I'm supposed to go this way What, what other material would I need? Gather materials to make a torch. Okay, well, what materials, though? I have firewood. 
What else would I need? Cloth? So maybe dip the wood in, maybe? Oh, maybe we can grab that, 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 uh, that dress that that hell Maria wanted to throw out. Where's the changing room? The changing room up here. No, not this way. I wasn't able to grab anything from that. Maybe I need to interact with the firewood with it? Boy, I don't have the materials to use this. The knife? What would the knife be used for though to make a torch? Oh, maybe to cut the fabric, maybe? Is that what you mean? Cut the fabric with the with the dagger? Maybe, I don't know. I don't know. Ah, ha ha! That's why you're my little Einstein bear. Little Einstein. For me, I just logically think she would just tear the fabric if it was like necessary. I didn't I didn't expect to have to use the dagger to rip fabric. Alright, let's go back to the reception. Hopefully maybe okay, maybe now we need the oil. Maybe. We'll see. Maybe dip the rag in oil. Bro. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna try and see if this works itself. Oh, wrong way. What else am I missing? I have cloth, I have the torch. I mean the firewood. Maybe dip the firewood into the oil? I tried using the cloth, but it... Hmm. Nope. Nope. What else would I need? The only other thing I can think of is to tie a cloth to the wood, but I don't know what. Huh. Where would I find fabric for that, though? Where would I find that?
cloth, firewood, and wire. Okay, so we need wire. Where are we going to find wire? Wire. Where are we going to find wire? Um, Something with wire, but... Can, am I just gonna leave the dagger on the floor? Can I not pick it up anymore? Pendant, but I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I guess they're both at peace, so I could just take it, but... No, I can't even grab the pendant. Let's see, let's try... Nope. Maybe outside? Maybe outside. Let me go back to the backyard. Was anything on that maid's cart? No, the only thing that was on the maid's cart was the gem.
Sure. I gotta get off soon, though, so maybe we should do a rain check on this. I might come back to this tonight. If it's such a short game, I can try finishing it later tonight. But it's already gonna be 11.30, so I probably should get off and start getting ready. But thank you guys again for stopping by. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate you guys being here. I'm a, I am very appreciative of the help. I didn't think I would need this much help on this game, but this game is stumping me so much. I think it's the fact that there's like lots of stuff that won't show unless like certain events happen. I think that's what's kind of like throwing me off and like making it really difficult. Uh, was fun. Hope work goes well. Thank you. I'll do my best. I'll do my best. Today's my Friday, so... So, yeah. There's always the, the end of the shift today to look forward to, because I have tomorrow off. So, yeah. Uh, I'll hopefully... I'll try to be on, since I do have tomorrow off. I'll try and do what I did last time, and log on and play for a little bit. Well, play, I guess, until I get tired. I'll buy myself a Red Bull tonight before I leave work and and yeah and then I'll just hang out here at night and play with you guys hopefully we can finish this tonight and then tomorrow we can jump on to yuppie psycho but yeah that's about all I have to say thank you guys for tuning in you're always appreciated here I hope your your days go well and I hope if it's nighttime for you I hope you have a great rest of your night and if anybody has any raid suggestions, please let me know. Um, since we have a couple people here right now, uh, we should probably do a raid. Let's see if any of our friends are on right now, though. Let's see if any of my friends are on. I think I saw Yuki online. Let's see if she's still on. Or if she's actually even on. Let me see. <gasps> Neurosama streaming. Let's raid Neurosama. Yeah, let's let's raid Neurosama. So you you people who have not been exposed to Neurosama, you're about to get exposed to Neurosama and her adorableness. All right, let's raid Neuro. All right, guys, jump on the raid train, please, and thank you, thank you. I hope you have a great time hanging out with Neuro. And I'll hopefully see you guys later tonight, okay? Alright, bye!